y'all welcome back to my channel i know i've been missing y'all i just needed like i needed a mental break you guys i'm not gonna lie i've been going through it i needed a mental break i got my break and i'm back and better so today's video is going to be my hot girl summer essentials i'm coming to show y'all everything that i love so far for the summer um i didn't want to do too much in this video because i don't i want to save some stuff for you know when i do my next one i can't give y'all everything in one video but i will tell y'all that today's video is sponsored by dacia perfumes y'all already know you already know this is a perfume company, okay, y'all? They make dupes for luxury brands. So like Tom Ford, Chanel, Giorgio Armani, all those expensive perfumes. If you want a dupe, you just go on Dacia Perfumes website and you get you a dupe. They are 100% vegan, 100% cruelty free. And that's the good part. And they do have a great return policy, you guys. If you purchase a perfume and you don't like it, Send it back to them. They ain't gonna ask you no questions. They'll give you your money back. Period. So they sent me two perfumes to try out for you guys today. So they sent me the first set is the Fruity Magnolia. She got what it looks like. Oh, and I did get my nails done. Fruity Magnolia. Yeah, so if you guys see this, don't worry about this. They don't sell these anymore. You do get a 50 ml bottle of perfume for $29. Let's smell it. Oh, I'm excited. Ooh. Oh my God. Y'all, this smells so fresh and fruity. I love Dossier so much, y'all, that I even went on the website myself and personally purchased some. I have a perfume in my car. I got a perfume in my gym bag. I got a perfume um, at work. I got a perfume in my locker where I shower. Like, I have, a, I have one of these literally everywhere okay the next scent they sent me is the floriental brown this is inspired by the mont ysl mont paris eau du parfum oh my god this smells like vanilla oh my god i knew it this has base notes of vanilla y'all i'll leave all the information on the screen this smells like vanilla cream pie or something this smells so good oh oh my god i just put on both of them no this smells oh my god y'all this is probably my favorite scent right now by them by dossier i love this damn dossier put this in my purse my birkin thank you so much to dossier for sponsoring this portion of today's video let's go ahead and hop right into the video child all right y'all because every time that i post something on instagram y'all go ballistic y'all be like where's this from 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 so i'm uh, making these videos to show y'all my favorites and tell y'all where it's from okay so if you are watching this video lucky you sis because i'm about to put you on to the motherfucking game okay so let's start with some skincare products or some beauty products that is killing me this summer child okay number one i never really use moisturizer when i do use moisturizer i used to use the clinique well when i did um i used to use the clinique some lotion i'll post it on the screen um, i went to dollar general and i was like let me try this pond's dry skin um i will leave everything linked down below you guys um this pond's dry skin cream facial moisturizer rich hydration let me tell you something. I bought this shit from Dollar General. I I don't care how hot it is outside. I don't care. I don't care. I could be drenched in sweat, bro. I need to put this on every day. This skin moisturizer, y'all. Let me tell y'all. I wash my face, right? Every time I wash my face, my face gets so dry. I don't know what's going on with my skin. But I cannot survive without that. So I really love this moisturizer, y'all. Um, apparently, I'm late to this moisturizer. Um, everyone knows about this but me. But I love this so much. Like, I can't wash my face without this. Like, I can't. If I wash my face and I don't have this with me, I f like, I just want to itch because I just don't feel right. This just makes my my skin so, like, smooth and just, oh, it just melts into my skin. I love this moisturizer. And it's so cheap. I'm never going back to no damn Clinique expensive-ass moisturizer. Hell no. Um, I'll leave everything linked down below for y'all so y'all can see. Then, y'all, I had went to Walmart. I came across this beauty brand called Cab Cosmetics. 
I bought this from Walmart for $10, right? It is a contour palette, y'all. And I seen it and I'm running out of contour um, powder. So I was like, let me just buy this shit. It can't be that good. Snatched. Snatched, y'all. Look at this shit. $10. I think, I think it was $10. I will put the price on the screen to make sure. So it comes with a translucent, a banana, a suntan, a caramel, a cinnamon, a sunshine, a sculpted, a bronze. Okay, y'all. So you, if you getting ready and you got you a nice little pretty little chocolate friend, um, your homegirl, she can use the bottom and you can use the top. Because I only use the banana and the suntan. And the suntan is still a little bit too dark for me. But this literally gives me, I don't know if y'all can see how like snatched i'm looking in the face and real slim but girl it's because of this palette so i really do love this though because you know, like i said with my homegirls is getting ready a lot of times when i be trying to get ready with my homegirls i be like girl you don't got shit in my shade and they say the same thing to me but now i got something for everybody okay from the lighter sister okay we got karen's right here from the lighter sister to well this ain't the darkest sister but y'all get what i'm saying like this palette is definitely worth the price and i know for a fact if this company can make this fire ass palette, I know they gotta have some good, uh, some other good stuff. So I am gonna go to Walmart and oops, bitch, I am gonna go to Walmart and check out some more of their products because this shit is life. Like it's already like getting all messy and stuff because I just be using the hell out of it. I'm surprised I haven't hit Pam, but I love that so much. I got a faha burn. If you know anything about surgery, um, I did get a faha burn and. Somebody kept telling me to get bio oil. I'm like, girl, what the fuck is this shit? I personally don't think none of this shit works. I didn't think Mederma, none of that skin shit. I'd be like, once you got a scar, you got a scar. It's not going to go away. Bitch, did I lie? I bought this from Walgreens. I bought this from Walgreens, y'all. Listen, don't purchase a bio oil on Amazon. They do sell a lot of fake... Um, Bio oil. Okay, y'all, y'all need to be careful where y'all get this shit from. Get it from Walgreens or um, Walmart or something. Don't get it online. I'm telling you, unless it's from like a reputable place. Bio oil, child. Yes. So let me tell you what I do. So after I shower, I put bio oil on my all my lipo scars, all my. So I put it. I have two. I have two holes right here under my stomach. I put it on my the top of my butt crack has a lipo hole, and I have my faha burn right here. So I put it right here. My faha burn is damn near almost gone. Um, it says you're supposed to use it for. Did you say thirty days? Oh, it says apply it twice daily for a minimum of three months. And bitch, I ain't do that. I've been using this. Actually, I have been using it for like two months. But this is my crack cocaine. And it's also good on your face. I do put it on my face as well. I'm trying to get my skin to just even out. But I love bio oil. I put this shit on all my scars. And the fact that my faha burn is literally, you can't even see it. I can see it because I know it's there. It's like little, it's like a month, not even a month. It's like two weeks away from being gone, sis. Please go get you some bio oil. This, you need bio oil. Like, all this shit I'm about to show y'all, y'all need. I don't care what nobody say. Yeah, let me show you guys what it looks like. I will leave everything linked down below for y'all. I bought these Crocs, y'all. Look at these fucking Crocs, child. So y'all know Nicki Minaj broke the internet. The queen. I love Nicki. I never really used to like, used to like Nicki, but I just fucking love Nicki. After I heard the Queen album, um, this was like a year ago, I think. I don't know, remember. After I heard the Queen album, I said Nicki is that bitch. Like, Nicki is the queen. She is just everything to me. So y'all know she posted that little uh, infamous... I know she posted that infamous um photo of her with those pink pink crocs on and um i already have pink crocs but i didn't want to get the pink ones so i got the black crocs designed i don't know some of you guys may not like these though y'all might think this is a little bit much oh my chain Y'all might think this is a little bit much but i absolutely love these crocs um i purchased this from a Instagram boutique. I will leave the Instagram boutique page down below and also on the screen for y'all. Um, I paid full price for this. This is not no like promo shout out or nothing. Um, if you guys like these, I would suggest you guys get them. She has them in so many different colors. If you do want to purchase, let her know that I sent you. She might give you a discount code. I don't know, but I mean, it don't hurt to try to get to save some money because I paid about one eighty for these, 
and I didn't realize that she had a discount code going on until after I purchased so I love these they're so comfortable I wear them everywhere oh and in case you guys are wondering I'm an eight and a half in women's but my Crocs are a seven in women so please make sure you size accordingly Let me put them on like this is so pretty and I got this fake ass Chanel bag that's black and gold so everything just goes and it's just so beautiful all right what's next for the shoes okay so there's like this style of shoes going on and I think this summer if you want to be a bad bitch if you want to look like a bad bitch if you want to grab if you want to walk in a room and grab all the attention you need these shoes I don't know what the fuck they call but um I got this pair from Fashion Nova I'll leave everything linked down below like I said and these this is how they look they are nude and they have clear straps can y'all see yes y'all can see and then it has like these this really different heel which I think is gorgeous and the best part is they are so comfortable I don't know what it is about these shoes where you, like your feet just slips in they're so comfortable the heels not high if y'all know I'm a tomboy at heart I can't walk in heels I, when it comes to heels baby girl I can like take a picture in them and I, them shit's coming right off um yeah but these are absolutely gorgeous and they're so comfortable y'all they're so comfortable and so beautiful so this style yeah like I told you I got this from Fashion Nova and then I also purchased this style this is from Rainbow let me tell y'all something I love Fashion Nova but Rainbow sell the same shit this dress I got on I paid two dollars and fifty cents two dollars and seventy cents at Rainbow okay y'all so don't let nobody tell y'all yeah get it from Rainbow so I purchased this shoe from Rainbow it has the same style um I think it's like a sandal I guess a sandal style where your feet just slides in these are really comfortable y'all I don't remember how much I paid for these I think I paid about like eight dollars at rainbow yeah I got them in black and I also got them in white but yeah I don't know what white ones are but yeah I got this from rainbow and this is in a size eight I am eight and a half in women so like I said just size down um, but these are so pretty these are also very comfortable oh the price is right here $19.99 but they were on sale trust me I'm not paying $20 for this um, but what I really really like about these um, these are good for like brunch you know what I'm saying um, it has a small little kitten heel it looks like some grandma shit but it's really actually sexy y'all especially with some um, nice jeans now why I think these are good for summer y'all let me tell y'all you have brunch with your little kitten heels right and then bam, they just start shooting. Bow, 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 bow. You could still run in this. I could, I could probably do my peach test in this. You could run in this. You could skip. You could hop. Your feet don't hurt. It literally feels so good. Like I just, I don't even like heels. But if I'm raving about some heels, that's a good thing. So these are just gorgeous. I really do love this style though. So I think I'm gonna cop more from um, an Instagram boutique or some shit. But yeah, I got the black one. I also got the white one. But these are just so gorgeous. I know y'all see these shoes everywhere, y'all. So y'all know Herm Hermes Hermes has these sandals with the H on it. They're a thousand dollars. Bitch, wear. I'm not paying a thousand dollars for no fucking flat ass sandals. Um, but Rainbow, like I told y'all, stop sleeping on Rainbow. I used to really think Rainbow was like whack, but now I know it's like actually not whack. But Rainbow had these um replica Hermes looking sandals. So I bought every color that they had because I'm sick like that. Um, these were ten dollars. Um, I got it in black. This is like a damn dupe. I'm not buying no thousand dollar fat ass sandals. So I got them in black, and these are so comfortable, y'all. I literally let me see if you guys can tell. I have worn the brakes off of this since I purchased them. Um, I've been wearing them all damn summer. I purchased them in um white as well um when you listen if y'all do get these sandals if i can find the link um when you first wear it it's a little it's a little snug right on while you feel it but the more you wear it the more the leather stretches so this is really good for ten dollars like if i could find these i'm probably gonna buy um a couple more pairs just because i can tell because they're cheap they're probably gonna get like i'm probably gonna cook them shit so fast so whatever but i got them in white and then i also got them in brown and I love this brown. Oh, look, it says 
I don't think I paid 12 dollars for these. I think I paid way less. But yeah, I got them in tan and white. Y'all, these are essential for the summer. Like, dead ass. These are so perfect. Like, this is for my army girls, okay? I bought these boots that I kept seeing everybody with. Everybody. Like, I used to see... I, I can't talk. So I would look at somebody, right? And I'd be like, damn, I really like those boots. And then I'd see somebody else and be like, I really like those boots. And then I came to realize that they were the same fucking boots that I was in love with. So I found... I actually, like got the courage and I purchased these online these are Nike I don't know what the, they're called because the box came literally damaged like I don't know what the fuck they're called but I'm pretty sure if you go on nike.com you'll see them I will find them for you guys um but these are so fire y'all like oh my god do y'all see these boots I have not worn them yet y'all I literally just got them a couple days ago so I can't really attest in my personal opinion about the if it's comfortable or not but everyone tells me they're comfortable so i just really based um my purchase on everybody else's reviews um but i really love these these are so cute they make your feet look so tiny this is a six and a half in boys yeah this is a six and a half in boys what size in women's it doesn't say yeah a six and a half in men that is all my boot size yeah all my boots are this size so i really love these aesthetically just so pleasing like these are so fire like but yeah i hope you guys do get this if you're in the army and you already got these comment down below let me know do y'all like the quality do y'all like um how does it fit etc but these are so cute like ladies first of all let's talk about it we got the ponytails we got the earrings we got the braids we got the pigtails we got everything we got the summer ocps you have to get these to just complete your look so you can look like a baddie it's nothing wrong with looking cute uniform. I be looking busted. I don't give a fuck, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, basically, that's it. I really love these boots. So I really just wanted to put y'all on because I know y'all gonna see me wearing them. Like, oh my God, where you get the boots from? I just wanted to put y'all on. What's next? Oh, y'all know I love uh, Missy Lynn. She's like one of my favorite YouTubers. She, about a couple months ago, she posted about these sandals. Um, these house sandals from Target. And it took me a while to find them. It took me a while to get them. What happened was Tiasia has this shit in every fucking. Tiasia has this shit in every color. So I tried hers on and I'm like, damn, those are so comfortable. So I find them on Target and I bought them. Um, I did also get one for a girl, a friend, somebody. But no, I really love this and they're really, really comfortable, y'all. Like Missy Lynn said. I would thought she was capping, but these shits are like mad comfortable. I purchased them in Sheeta and in white. Oh, sorry guys, kind of washed out, but I purchased them in white and in Sheeta. Put them on right now. You can size up. Tia just said she sized up just so like it could be more comfortable. But I really love these. These are comfortable, perfect for the crib, perfect for some Netflix and chill in the summertime. I know you guys have seen this bag everywhere. This bag is from um, a boutique on Instagram called Saturday House. I'll leave her Instagram on the screen as well. She don't know me. I just purchased it. Um, she does releases, I think, every two weeks or once a week. Um, this literally, me and Tiesha had to have the website on the iPad and on our iPhones just so we can get this. This shit sold out. Her bags sell out in like three minutes. Literally, I saw it with my own eyes. They sold out in three minutes. Like We had to keep refreshing. We were like screaming because our order went through. But this is, um, it's basically a replica Birkin, but it kind of adds a little humor to it in a sense. She has this in so many colors. I'm gonna tell y'all what color I want so bad. I want the fucking green and pink one so bad. I don't even know. I, I got this color, but I don't really have shit to match with it. So I don't even know why I really got it, but whatever. But yeah, it's just a fake Birkin and it says, you fake like this Birkin. And it's just so cute and it has so much space in it. Oh my god. I'm about to go ahead and order me three more. Um, it has so much space in it, y'all. This is perfect for the summertime. I know they got this whole shit going online about Birkins and shit. Bitch, who the fuck is paying $15,000? $15,000 for a fucking bag. First of all, that's a car. First of all, that's a down payment on a house. I don't care. I just, I'm not that rich, so maybe that's why I say that, but 
realistically, like people just spend their money like maniacs. I'm not paying fifteen thousand dollars for a fucking purse. That a basic ass purse like this, like what the fuck? But um, yeah, so I just got this because it just it adds a little humor. It's perfect for the summer. She does have smaller sizes if you do want to get a smaller size. Um, but yeah, tell her I sent you, and she might give you a discount code. I don't fucking know. But yeah, I really like this though. This is my baby. I do want some different colors for the summer. Just so if you, I know, because sometimes I do be saying I want a Birkin because everybody got a Birkin, but all the celebrities got a Birkin. But I do want, um, this at least makes me feel included somewhat. So I really do love this. And the quality is amazing. It doesn't peel or no shit like that. It comes with a strap. It comes with a lot of shit actually. So yeah, that's that. Those are the items that I'm loving for the past um, couple of months. I really, I'm trying my best to put y'all on to stuff. Um, I'm trying my absolute best to put y'all on to more stuff like, cause y'all always ask me where I get my stuff from. So this is it for today's video. If you have used anything that I mentioned, comment down below, let me know how you like it or if you don't like it or if I'm tripping. That might be, I might be tripping. I don't know. But yeah, that is it for today's video. I love you guys and I'll leave everything linked down below. Look at this bob. Stupid weird. But yeah, so I love you guys and I will see y'all in my next video. I lied, bitch. I lied. I lied. I gotta put y'all onto this. Where the fuck is the Casamigos?